hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is Sagar Fujapati and in this video I will be talking about one of the most interview Python in question which has been asked in a recent interview so before the video I would like to introduce my channel geek coders here I upload videos on Azure Data Factory, Azure Data Big, SQL, Python and so on so if you are beginner or if you are planning for a, a job switch then you can refer to this channel and uh, and get benefited okay so let's get started for today's video so let me go back to my online compiler that is uh, programmis.com you can use your offline compiler if you have downloaded this python in your local system okay so the question is reverse word of of like reverse order of words so what does it mean is that let's say i have one sentence okay let's say this is geek coders okay so now you have to reverse this uh, sentence okay so what does it mean is that this is input right and the output should be like geek coders is this and this is the output okay this is the output so let's get started so what i will do is that first is that you know this is the sentence right this is one string so i will break this string i will convert this string i will convert this string into the uh, into the array okay so what will i do first is that i will create one function let's say def words reverse and i will pass here sentence so uh, what I will do I will create sentence list and I will write down here what sentence dot split with spaces because in a sentence you know we have the spaces in between the words so if I try to print this sentence then you can you know you can see what is the output over here this is geek coders okay so uh, you know i have to do here return so if i did it then you can see the output is this is geek coders in an array okay so this is the first index second index like in the like this is the last index okay so now what we can do is that we can iterate like we can iterate from the from this uh, you know from this array till the end of the array and pop up something like pop up from the last okay so what i can do i can write down write down while send sentence underscore list sorry sentence and i will go till the end so if well while length of this is zero is greater than zero okay so here what i will do i will uh, write one i mean i will initialize one variable let's say word and word is equal to sentence dot pop pop is a predefined function okay and then what i will do i i have to initialize one uh, one list let's say list of words is equal to empty and here i have to i have to append it that's it and at last what i will do i will return i will return list underscore words dot join so once i click on this run button then you can see the sentence is geek coders is this which is the expected output okay 
so why i have done this is that you know if i simply return if i simply return list word then it will return in an array or we can say in a list but we need a sentence right we need to we need to combine or we can, we, we 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 need to we need to uh, concat concat the whole list into the you know with the spaces like we, with the spaces so that's why i have used it so let me remove this sentence this thing and let me just run it then you can see it like this is the uh, list or this is the array right so the our output should be like this so that's why what we need to do is that we need to join this with the spaces okay because we need to create a sentence so this is the uh, like this is the question and this is the solution and the order of complexity is order of n okay and uh, uh, like the, the the time complexity is order of n and like there 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 could be multiple solution of this problem you can solve it via, via different approaches but i have solved this with this approach and maybe you have you you will solve this problem in with a different approach so if you have any other solution you can ping me or you know you you can comment out comment those solution into the comment box so that everyone will learn you know and uh, i hope you have understood this concept and uh, please make sure like if you're planning or if you're preparing for an interview any interview maybe data engineers or software developer and so on then prepare these kind of questions you will like in the first round especially in the first round you will be asked these kind of questions only okay so yeah that's it for today's video i hope you have understood this concept and if you do do like and share